surreal scene in the San Bernardino Mountains. Those are cars buried in snow. This video shot near Lake Arrowhead. Snow plows working all day to clear the area around Highway 173 and North Bay Road. CHP confirms at least three accidents in that area today. The severe weather does make for some pretty pictures, though. The San Bernardino Mountains are under their first ever blizzard warning. People looking forward to epic skiing in the mountains had to work pretty hard to get there. Susan Harrison is at the Chain Checkpoint Highway 18. That's about 10 miles from Lake Arrowhead. Susan. Yeah, and never have I ever been in a situation where I checked rather the, the directions to get somewhere. Like, for example, we were supposed to get as far up as Running Springs, and the directions say, no, you can't get there because there are, you know, there are closures up ahead. And this is where you get stopped to be sure that you put on the chains. That's the sign that it, everyone dreads seeing, but it is trying to keep people safe. The most direct route to Big Bear, Highway 330, was closed down in the flatlands. The roadblock meant Brian Bodner would have a long way home to Running Springs. The roads are drivable. Okay. They're just, they got them blocked. They're saying it's conditions, but it's not conditions. Um, I haven't had any issues in 15 years of living there, getting up and down. Highway 18 remained open, but chain controls went up barely 12 miles up the road. With four wheel drive? Here's why. Early morning video shows how much snow fell and how much the roads needed plowing. At this vista point, lots of beefy SUVs and trucks with giant tires pulled over to put on chains. Vince Chua had to go back down the mountain to buy chains. Dressed like this, he was smart to get some professional help. Well, I haven't installed chains in so long, but they're able to do it so quick, and I'd rather not be out here for 30 minutes trying to install chains. So, you know, you pay for a service. Forty to eighty dollars will get help to install the chains and may save on frustrations. Instead of letting the professionals do it, we're going to let him do it. Do you feel pretty confident you can get these cables on? Yeah, pretty confident. Yeah. Unfortunately, the confidence was crushed when the couple realized the cables didn't fit. Yeah, we're going to go back down and get chains that fit. Experience helps. I've been living plus 30 years on the mountain, so I know what I'm doing. And some might curse the road closures and chain requirements, but not Umberto Granados. It's a good thing. Is it? Actually, you know, safety first. Yeah. We don't want like get people stuck. All right. So I also checked the uh, the directions to get to Big Bear and. If you want to get to Big Bear, the best way is to go Highway 38. That area is open. But again, it's quite likely that there will be other chain requirements for that area. So just be prepared. And also, here's this pro tip. Buy the chains, the right size chains, down away from this area because a lot of people I talked to said, oops, we need chains. They go back down to Highland, go to the auto zone there. But, you know, they're going to run out, especially when you need a specific size. Reporting live, Ian San Bernardino, Susan Hirasuna, Fox 11 News.